हेलो हेलो okay so in the previous lecture uh, we discussed about the steps in planning or planning process how planning should be done so have you correlated uh, this thing uh, with your any of the planning in any one example you people can share few people shared in the previous lecture any example from your side somebody told a study material study project from that side anybody any one activity you could correlate with these steps online people A anyone uh, any anyone uh, what we can say any one uh, step you find significant out of these st steps significance means you think like uh, it's so much important okay paper presentation good so you are planning for paper presentation so establishing objectives identifying the real problem so in industry you people have to do this activities for every uh, activity a plan for every plan you should follow this yes yes this i have seen no paper presentation somebody told this anybody else so as per my knowledge all steps are significant and uh, all are essential in every plan so you should follow all these steps so remembering this thing is quite uh, difficult so if you remember uh, this chart uh, this flow chart from establishing objective to identify the real problem collecting and analyzing the data or information then determining the planning premises identifying the alternative course of action evaluation of it then selecting the uh, final course of action and follow up action so uh, this chart is very very essential right so instead of writing the uh, text i uh, request you you people can draw this chart and remember the steps in planning so in exam there may be the short note like a uh, write a short note on steps in planning slash process in planning so there are basically eight steps that you should follow
draw this chart. completed so anything you want to ask from this particular bit i feel uh, it is very very important because i told like you people will able to prepare the planning after learning this particular unit you people will be able to illustrate the planning so we discussed the meaning we discussed the classification types of plans then we discussed like how plans should be uh, prepared how many steps you should follow right so if there is no doubt then uh, we'll proceed to next point that is decision making okay so decision making is one of the part uh, in planning is uh, essential so let us discuss uh, what is the meaning of decision decision making and how many element decision making has so decision making uh, this is one of the word most of the time and in daily routine uh, you people do this activity right so let us discuss uh, one by one what is the meaning of decision so decision is a choice made between two or more available alternatives is it true choice made between two or more available alternative you have uh, four five options and you have chosen one so means what you have done in this process you have uh, taken the decision right so decision making is the process of choosing the best alternative for the reaching objectives so why decision making is important in planning because this uh, point is belongs to planning itself so we discussed uh, planning aspects but in uh, planning decision making is very very essential because uh, you are uh, choosing the alternative course of action right so decision making activity is very very essential so in decision making what you are doing you are choosing the best alternative and for what purpose you are choosing this best alternative you have to reach to objective right in planning objective whatever you have decided you have to reach it reach there so for that purpose your decision making should be proper right and in decision making what we do we choose one option out available out of many options one you can choose then you can say like you made the decision so if you have five you choose like four so is it appropriate decision no so if you choose one then you can select decision is made properly so decision making can be defined as process of choosing alternatives to achieve a goal it is the process by which individual choose one alternative from several to achieve the desired objective so same uh, sentence uh, same meaning you can uh, correlate here so in short decision is one of the activity where you choose make the choice out of many options and you choose one right and decision making is the process where you have various options various alternatives and why you are doing this process because you have to achieve goals 
right? And uh, obviously, which goals we are discussing about the industry. So, industry in industry we see like um, in previous bit related to uh, this uh, st uh, steps in planning. First step itself is uh, establishing objective or establishing goals, and you have to achieve it. And for that process, decision making is very very essential. Now, decision making has many various characteristics. So, first characteristic is that it is a goal oriented process. तुम्ही चूज करता मैं तुमसे कहते हैं गोल है जितना, right? कि माला है अचीव कर रहे थे, so that's why I have chosen this, right? So uh, for example, I want to join social so organization. This is your goal, right? You don't want to join the TCS. So you have taken the taken the decision like uh, you want to join it first, and another one you started preparing on aptitude uh, languages, right? So it's your decision, and you are to uh, achieve that particular goal. This decision making process is essential. Then it involves different alternatives. Decision making involves different alternatives. So if you don't have options, then you have only one. How you may, will make the decision? So you have alternatives. Alternatives means you have various options. So that's why you can make the decision. So this is one of the characteristic of decision making. Then it is a dynamic process. Dynamic process means you can say like it's a fast process. How? Apan man toh ka aaj bhook lag liye. Mang jevna sa decision me don't asa nahi gato. Asa hot nahi, right? So uh, you are far away eating. You you are taking decision. I have to eat. But it is a fast process, right? Asa kya nahi kya tab me niwan bhook to don't asa nandar. Asa nahi. In industry also same thing. So it is a dynamic process. You should not think like uh, tomorrow I will do this decision. You have to uh, think about the priority, and then you have to take the decision. And obviously, it is a dynamic process. As I said, delay or decision making should be a quick activity, right? That you have to take the halo panna bedla, consultant na bedla, chamber lo panna bedla, and among the decision we have. So it should not be like that, right? In decision making, uh, this process should be a dynamic. Decision should be taken quick. Otherwise, uh, decision making could not be done. Because ability is there, if you are not able to decide. If you are not able to choose one option out of various industry, that situation is there. HR may also have situation like he has ten employees. You want to uh, miss interviewer. He is taking interview of ten people, but he want only five. So he should think like today only, depending on the various aspect. Like I want to choose these five only. So the quick option, option, action, eh? Na, as I say, that if the two days or three days or one year or two years. विचार करता है तुम्हें कुछ लगे तो इट्स नॉट लाइक दैट राइट सो डिसीजन मेकिंग दिस प्रोसेस इज डायनामिक प्रोसेस दिस इज वन ऑफ द इंपॉर्टेंट कैरेक्टरिस्टिक ऑफ डिसीजन मेकिंग इट इज अफेक्टेड बाय एनवायरमेंट मींस टुडेज डिसीजन एज पर योर ओपिनियन इट्स करेक्ट बट टुमारो इट मे नॉट बी करेक्ट असो हो सकता टुडेज एज पर द एनवायरमेंट सिचुएशन एज पर द टुडेज कंडीशन यू हैव टेकन दैट डिसीजन एंड यू फील लाइक इट्स करेक्ट टुडे But tomorrow it may wrong because it is affected by environment. Sakrasa godam, you mala watle kiya tha kamy kharcha madhe apne achha madhe thiye hai. Kota virus thiye hai. Open uh, place madhe sakar. But you don't know about the environment. Huh? Rain comes and you know what happen next. So today's decision is right, but tomorrow it may be wrong. So in short, decision making is affected by environment, not only uh, physical environment. Situation, finance situation, employee situation, owner situation, recession situation. We don't know. Not only environment means this a physical environment which we are understanding. Beyond that also environment may be there. So that's why decision making is a uh, uh, this uh, environment based. It may affected by environment. It is a continuous process. Decision making. Today decision get la udhar but those decision over the you should act. It should not be like that. Ata chale, so chalo dia ta. Me sangit like that decision. It should be a continuous process. It should be done continuously, and it is an intellectual process. It is an intellectual process means decision. Heta na, eda ka bade se kam nahi hai. So in short, right? So there, intelligent people should be there, right? And uh, without intelligence, you cannot take appropriate decision. So that's why it is one of the characteristic. Like it is a intellectual process. 
तुम्हाला ब्रेनचा आय क्यू सगळ्या गोष्टी वापरून तुम्हाला तो डिसिजन घ्यायचा आहे दिस इज अ इंटलेक्च्युअल प्रोसेस सो दिस आर दिस कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ डिसिजन मेकिंग डिसिजन मेकिंग हॅज व्हेरियस फॅक्टर्स लाईक कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स वी कॅन से नॉट फॅक्टर्स कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स आर यू अग्रीड विथ दिस कॅरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ डिसिजन मेकिंग Do you want to add something like, sir? This is also one of the characteristics. I have brought few for discussion purpose. It may have various angles. Decision making is a goal oriented. It involves alternative, dynamic process affected by environment. It's continuous process, intellectual process. Anything you want to add? From my side, sufficient six characteristics. question may be like um, uh, illustrate the decision making with various example so you should write characteristics you should write definition you should write various features right so factors of decision making one of the part related to decision making obviously uh, certain factors are uh, important while making decision perception Have you heard about this word perception? Mazamat ka hai, mazo opinion ka hai, right? So perception, you have to understand the people perceptions also. What they think, what they are uh, feeling, what is their opinion. Aso na ki I think like it is a true. Yes, it may be true for you, but you are decision maker for not only. yourself you are decision maker for as a manager for a whole organization right so perception is one of the factor while making decision priorities priority means yes numbering or yes. no in any other word alternative word pradhanya प्राधान्य इन मराठी वी कॉल प्राधान्य प्रेफरन्स प्रायोरिटी प्रेफरन्स राईट सो अनदर अल्टरनेटिव्ह वर्ड इज अवेलेबल सो यू शुड थिंक लाईक आय हॅव टू मेक डिसिजन रिगार्डिंग फोर फाईव्ह थिंग्स विच डिसिजन आय शुड टेक नाव राईट सो प्रायोरिटी फॉर डिसिजन इट्स नॉट लाईक दॅट यू हॅव ओनली वन यू हॅव टू टेक ओनली वन डिसिजन एज अ मॅनेजर सो वाईल टेकिंग डिसिजन यू हॅव व्हेरियस ऍस्पेक्ट सो विच शुड बी टेकन फर्स्ट right so this is one of the factor while making decision you need to consider priorities priorities may, may be owner owner may have uh, suppose you got the uh, mail from the director and one mail from the owner at the same time where you will reach for important meeting right so what is your priority you should reach them uh, him and you should say like i was ha having a meeting with so and so person or you should say like i have meeting with important meeting with laborers you can postpone it right so you know priority is what not to engage with the laborers because you can manage meeting afterwards they can understand but owner or director may not understand right so understand means it's priority it is decided like he called me you should reach so i got i think uh, this point related to priority the next one is that acceptability so you have to think like whether this decision will be acceptable or reject rejectable as in the nature people will accept or reject it so this is also one of the aspect uh, you people have to consider while taking decision risk somebody is there who is there no 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 important no any importance Who is there? Yes. 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 Okay. She so want to join this class. Ask her. No problem. Okay. So we were discussing about the risk. So while taking a decision, risk is implied. Who will answer for this? The risk. You are taking risk means most of the time uh, there is. You are taking decision means there is a risk. because sometimes it may be wrong no your decision sometimes may be wrong 
and if there is a loss or there is a failure right so therefore there is a risk simple any any another aspect related to this risk decision and risk some people use calculated risk word calculated risk risk means sometime we feel like danger right risk and danger so but both the words are different yes rishikesh what, what is the problem yes you come now why are you disturbing people you should immediately ask and join the class why you are late so uh, we were discussing about the calculated risk and uh, plainly risk if you say like um, a danger right and uh, danger means uh, people will not take the risk that's why a very well known word phrase you can say like uh, calculated risk means you have uh, study behind it it's not like that you have taken the risk uh, blindly blind risk you can say and calculated risk two things you can say so risk is implied whenever you are taking decision but if you have calculated risk then no problem so failure will not be there resources so while taking decision you should consider the one of the factor that is resources resources may be machine man money right to produce your product whatever things required you can assume like these are the resources getting so resources also you should consider while taking a decision you have committed to somebody like yes i will give so a number of compound 1000 compound every day but you have to consider this means before taking this decision or before giving this commitment you should think like whether i do i have resources along with me if resources are not there then how you will um, give this uh, order to that particular party means you have taken decision but you have not considered your resources so resources consideration is very very essential before taking any decision getting okay. then goals this is also one of the part decision making so what are the goals aple malka che goal vegle tan aple goal vegle apun vegle decision getla aso hal nako what our owner what organization expect so in line with that you should take decision right what are the goals of organization similar decision align decision should be there so this factor you should consider before taking any of decision in the organization values morals ethics values so this is also important paisa sathi kutla pan values mulya pan manto ne ka ka manto apan ela ethics matche chapter me shiklo ethics values naitik mulya wagare right paisa milto man kay pan karaycha and decision guys are paisa milnar hai so it should not be like that so while taking decision values should be considered uh, everywhere then demands whether demand is there demand for product if you are taking decision to produce certain product you have to understand like whether uh, demand is there or not you have taken decision to produce but demand is there or not right so this is also need to be considered then styles कुठल्या स्टाईल कुठल्या स्टाईलने तुम्ही हे घेताय डिसिजन घेताय काय म्हणतात त्याला स्वतः कुणाचं ओपिनियन न घेता सो मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम पीपल टेक डिसिजन लोनली लाईक येस आय आय वील आय हॅव डिसाइडेड दिस बट यू शुड टेक ओपिनियन फ्रॉम समबडी सो स्टाईल्स ऑफ लिडरशिप वन ऑफ द बीट इज देअर इन नेक्स्ट चॅप्टर सो देअर विल सी व्हेरियस स्टाईल्स ऑफ पीपल सो दिस इज ऑल्सो वन ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टंट फॅक्टर अँड जजमेंट judgment is also important while taking decision technical study scientific based study no problem but a judgment is also important so while taking decision you people should think about these various factors and in daily life also you, you can correlate such a points with the daily life right so what other people will think priority acceptability so you think like lecture is not important but some another work is important as over then i have to meet somebody and this is very essential so you priority is lecture as a student but beyond that if you have priority so you have to decide it right 
any any doubt in this decision making factors anything anybody want to add like sir this is also one of the factor we should consider while taking decisions and uh, always think like decision related to organization uh, industry we are not uh, discussing generalized like daily life i am giving the examples you should not write in examination but for understanding purpose i am giving this otherwise you will think like uh, exam made industry oriented i have given all the examples you can write your own examples also and in planning it is essential this decision making is essential yes. cost of product yes cost of product is also important before uh, taking decision to produce is there any financial points right good good point like us जजमेंट मध्य यस पार्शली इट मे बी देर बट कॉस्ट फैक्टर मे बी सेपरेट डिपेंडिंग ऑन प्रोडक्ट विच प्रोडक्ट यू आर प्रोड्यूसिंग एनीबडी एल्स वॉन्ट टू कंट्रीब्यूट अदरवाइज यू विल प्रोसीड एक्सेप्टेबिलिटी है कि प्रोडक्ट यूर एक्सेप्टेबिलिटी मध्य शिंग डिजन इन इंडस्ट्री एंड इन प्लैनिंग दिस दिस इज वन ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टंट पार्ट एंड वी डिस्कस वेरियस फैक्टर्स लाइक दीज आर दूड फैक्टर वी शुड कन्सिडर वाइल मेकिंग डिशीजन if there is no addition uh, let us proceed with uh, next point online people also can respond hmm, in chat box i can see uh, your message now here is types of decision uh, before going for uh, decision uh, types so like basic decision administrative decision organizational decision right so this is a classification types so one by one we have to discuss but before that what we will do we will note this uh, uh, definition and then we will write uh, characteristics and then factors okay so let us start with decision making decision and decision making title will be decision and decision making definitions so don't write second sentence almost it is similar first uh, sentence first bullet you can note decision is a choice made between two or more available alternatives
note the characteristics of decision making <coughs> characteristics of decision making first one it is a goal oriented process if you are not agreed with some of the sentences because th these are the bullets no this is not complete sentence most of the time so you should ask the doubt in between also it involves different alternatives it involves different alternatives it is a dynamic process it is a dynamic process note it fast up to six sentence the next factors of decision making factors of decision making if question is for 7 mark 8 mark you should able to elaborate i have given ample points from definition to characteristics to factors and now classification last one so at mark at kay pane hote ami linear online exam okay but in iic in iic you people will get questions iic also online you people have to upload the answer sheet now nah, certificate also online good is yes, note the points factors
or decision making or you can say uh, type the title like or write the title types of decision types of decision and listen carefully how many types of decisions will be there types of decision so uh, you can say like basic decision or strategic decision administrative decision organizational or personal decision policy decision individual and group de uh, decision routine decision adaptive decision so most of the words now i think uh, well known to you but what comes under that particular decision that we have to discuss so first a uh, type of decision is basic decision or strategic decision so uh, धोरणात्मक निर्णय म्हणू शकतो आपण स्ट्रॅटेजिक डिसिजन म्हणजे धोरणात्मक निर्णय सो मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम इन ऑर्गनायझेशन दिस इज अ व्हेरी इम्पॉर्टंट डिसिजन ऍज इट इज रिलेटेड टू मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम लार्ज इन्व्हेस्टमेंट लार्ज रेंज इन्व्हेस्टमेंट इफ इट इज देअर देन पीपल टेक सच काइंड ऑफ डिसिजन कारण पैसे इन्व्हेस्ट करतायत तर तो डिसिजन हा कसा असला पाहिजे लॉंग टर्म ला धोरण धोरणच तुमचे डिसिजन असले पाहिजे धोरणात्मक डिसिजन असले पाहिजे अदरवाइज रॅन्डमली इफ यू इन्व्हेस्ट सो इट इज मिस रिटर्न यू विल नॉट गेट इन दॅट केस सो ऑल बेसिक डिसिजन इन्वॉल्व लार्ज रेंज कमिटमेंट ऑर लार्ज इन्व्हेस्टमेंट कमिटमेंट इन्व्हेस्टमेंट लार्ज रेंज म्हणजे लॉंग टर्म वॉट एव्हर ऍक्टिव्हिटी यू आर टेकिंग ऑर डुईंग इन द फ्युचर सो इट कम्स अंडर दी बेसिक डिसिजन ऑर स्ट्रॅटेजिक डिसिजन बेसिक डिसिजन अँड स्ट्रॅटेजिक डिसिजन वन अंड दिस the so slight uh, or small mistake if it is happen in this decision then what is the punishment can you see so there you will be the serious problem to your entire organization because you are investing long term money or you are giving the long term commitment to any of the party ekadya foreign client la you are giving certain commitment like we will use so and so product right and large party is there and if you are not able to do it then there is a huge injury to your organization and there will be the huge loss so basic decision or and or strategic decision should be taken very seriously and should be taken appropriate and for what purpose such kind of decisions are required to take large range decisions let it be related to a uh, commitment that it let it be related to investment or let it be related to uh, enhancing your organization or enlarging your organization expand growth of an organization in that case also so this is one of the type of decision then administrative decision so there are two types programmed decision and non programmed decision so two uh, decision types are there administration maje kasa manta tumhi so what meaning you take well, i think this is this word is there for four five times administrative decision authority kind of right so uh, official kind of thing so uh, there are two types basically programmed decision and non programmed decision in programmed decision uh, basically it involves organizations developed a specific process for handling decision specific process already organization has developed to uh, handle sp specific decision for example uh, sanctioning leave of employee in the organization so what is the procedure employee should apply and concerned authority should sign that person should adjust his load whatever duty he has and then he should go on the leave every organization this is a common practice so this is coming under the program decision already that decision is taken right like you want to take leave means what procedure you should follow programming is done nowadays uh, erp software are there so you, uh, you have heard about this erp software enterprises resource resource planning in uh, entrepreneurship development next year we are going to discuss but such a software comes under the pro program decision erp software means what software will uh, you will give input to software software will process it and you will get certain output getting suppose you need lc in our college also we have uh, this uh, erp software so if you want to take lc so you have to apply automatically you will get the printed lc with correct data so it is in going process even copo mapping we have erp software our work uh, you may have heard about this so 
already developed a spe uh, this specific process for handling decision so it comes under the programmed decision and non programmed decision uh, related uh, to the general problem solving process they involve judgment intuition and creativity means as per the requirement as per the judgment uh, you you are taking the decision right so uh, intuition means what intuition antarnyan thodasa atun aale ki mala vatle he asa karaycha intuition maza intuition kay ahe so depending on that you are, if you are taking the decision means personalized decisions are there that's why these are the non programmed decision there is no specific process right so this comes under the administrative decision there are two types automatic decision non automatic decision right so in that way you also can remember then a next type of decision uh, organizational slash or uh, personal decision so organizational decision reflects company policy they can be delegated or transferred to others what is organizational decision organization uh, decision reflects company policy means what company has decided company ni policy tharavli means the company cha to nirnay people should get 30% hike every year improvement i like means this is salary increment so this is already decided people should get a bonus every uh, diwali occasion this is a policy of organization so it is not of manager's decision that way right it is organization's decision so such a decisions are coming under the organizational decision and they can be delegated or transferred to other owner has decided like i should give bonus to my employees right so people will work on it no owner ni the tyachi garaj nahi hai so he will say to his managers like you give bonus to uh, this this employees means he delegated the authority such a decision organizational decisions can be delegated principals load can be adjusted to any any person like the student if principal is not available then there is no another principal no already man, this organization has decision like principal should be there right for the running organization but if principal is ill principal is having outside duty he is on duty leave then he should delegate his authority to somebody no? what the idea so uh, such a decisions can be delegated and transferred to other tumhi acha divas majha kaam kara so you can sign on behalf of me so it is allowed so such a uh, decisions are called as organizational decision and personal decision means what personal decision refer to those made by the manager as an individual and this cannot be delegated manager has decided like so and so work should be done for it effective work in the organization effective production uh, effective quality whatever it may be manager has decided so his it's his decision right so you can say like his personal decision of manager but can it be delegated to other me asa decision getla udya to face me ki asa decision kele you carry forward it not possible because we don't know his intuition what is his intention why he has taken decision another person may not be knowing so such a decisions cannot be delegated it cannot be handed over to somebody what the idea so this is called as a personal decision then next one is the policy decision policy decisions are taken by the top management policy decision kon karta always top management middle man management and lower management always follow they are follower top management decide the policies right so such a decisions you can say like uh, this is a policy decision kuni getlele decision top management ni getlele decision policy decision asta because they take the decision means it becomes policy people should get uh, this uh, incentive if they perform well right incentive is in, incentive systems are there so how much it should be decided right and this should be comes under uh, by the uh, you can say like uh, uh, in the form of document ठीक आहे लक्षात ठेवणार आहे का साहेबांनी सांगितलं होतं मालकांनी सांगितलं होतं 
remembering the things quite difficult so it comes as a policy another example i have uh, quoted here like uh, bonus already example i have given like uh, the declaration of the bonus is a company's policy which is to be decided by the top management right bonus there is top management's job while calculation and distribution of bonus is a operating decision which is done by the lower level management policy like the policy decision means what top level people whatever they decide it becomes policy and remaining people have to follow let it be related to uh, uh, bonus let it be related to incentive maybe like insurance health mediclaim whatever it may be so like that decisions uh, taken by the top management are the policy decisions then individual and group decisions the decision taken by an individual in the organization is known as a individual decision labor ne tharavla mi ya ve ni matter yon jato i will follow next time this way his is his own decision no so it can be a individual decision manager ne sanglo ta aso yon jato so he feel told like i will go by this way so he feel like uh, it, this is efficient way so the such a decisions can be individual decision and group decisions may be like uh, uh, decisions decisions which are taken by the group may be like a uh, uh, board of director committee expert committee expert uh, so spelling mistake is there committer uh, this expert committee experts group of labor may be group of managers if such a decisions are taken such a decisions comes under the group decisions then next one is the routine decision routine name itself is telling the type of decision made when problems are relatively well defined this uh, this uh, decisions made when problems are relatively well defined and common then establish the rules policies and procedures can be used to solve them means what everything is well every day we have to do this and everything is defined salary should be done every month office la sangile administrative department la sangile on the 30th salary should be released then it should be this is a routine no every month this is a routine 12 month in a year same routine is there right so such a decisions are coming under the routine decision i think uh, one more decision is there uh, adaptive decision the type of decision made when problems and alternative solutions are somewhat unusual and only partially understood we don't know what is happening kam problem hai to hai in machinery there is one certain problem machine is not working properly but you take an another uh, solution for that alternative solution for that ani asa hot nahi kadi pan aaj jhale asa hot in industry machine vyavasthit work hot nahi hai even we done the uh, preventive maintenance in that situation which type of decision manager should take adaptive decision परिस्थिति अनुकूल अनुकूल वगैरह सो अडप्टीव डिशीजन एज पर दिच्युएशन परिस्थिति अनुरूप डिशीजन यू शुड टेक सच डिशीजन आर दी अडप्टीव डिशीजन सो सच डिशीजन विल बी देर इन इंडस्ट्री सो वी हेव कैटेगराइज पीपल आर डूइंग दिस मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम बट दे डोट नो वी अंडर विच कैटेगरी विच डिशीजन इज i think there these many decisions uh, types are there so how many types we see seven types so is there any doubt out of this seven uh, we can discuss otherwise uh, we will stop here because uh, next bit is organizing so we discuss like planning organizing and staffing will be the three parts of this particular unit and we have completed first part that is planning is there any doubt related to planning third one organization and personal decision next one okay okay this one you want this one second one
non program program decision have you understood like uh, there is a specific process for handling uh, activity or uh, taking the decision programmers kela kay program kela um, how i have given example of leave sanctioning or another example will take like uh, how people should be recruited like first aptitude test then group discussion right then um, personal interview technical interview this is a procedure decided by uh, hr department in this way they recruit the people so this is a program decision no why manager or new hr should uh, have his own interpreter already is decided no program is it in this way you should recruit the people when they will come we should give the three months training decided no in this process that uh, this process should be followed by everybody because it is programmed as is procedure hai because this is a specific process you can uh, underline this word specific process so program decision you understood now second one is a non programmed decision so they are related to general problem solving process general problem solving process and they involve judgment intuition and creativity means what so as per the requirement parasthiti badalli so by judgment by your own intuition by your own creativity you take the decision but these are they not decided but you think like if i take decision in this way creativity will be there in this there will be the benefit benefits to organization i am taking decision uh, for the organization only. for the betterment of organization you are taking this decision because you followed certain creativity certain time you say like judgment nahi asa nahi honar he wazandar hai he halke hai such kind of judgment judgment we make i cannot give appropriate example but simple example i have given you take the uh, decision by judgment प्रोग्राम नौता यू यू या इम्प्लाइड युअर ओन डिशीजन बाय जजमेंट बाय क्रिएटिविटी बाय इंट्यूशन तुम्हारा अतन कि नहीं चुकी से अशा पद्धति जाए इंट्यूशन अंतरज्ञान है तुम्हारा तुम्हार इंटेलेक्चुअल सो इफ यू टेक सच ए डिशीजन दीज आर ए नॉन प्रोग्राम डिशीजन राइट वॉट द आइडिया ओके सो ऑनलाइन पीपल यू कैन पुट रोल नंबर इन चार्ट बॉक्स एंड लीव द मीटिंग